Hello everyone and welcome to a quick tutorial on how to drive the uh, NASCAR Sprint Cup car around Sonoma. I know for many uh, NASCAR racers coming to Sonoma is taking you out of your comfort zone. It's a track that we don't race that often and it's a track that you're not really used to and I'm hoping this video will be able to help you navigate around the course. Uh, for the rookies I hope this introduces the importance of smooth application of throttle and brake and steering and gears and for the veterans maybe it gives you some new braking points or tells you some new lines around the course so uh, without further ado here we come down the front straightaway uh, be careful the walls on the inside and on the outside you don't want to wash up into those uh, we now come flying up the hill into the first corner and you want to start braking pretty early shift down into second even into first if it's absolutely necessary it's depending on your gear setup don't be afraid to get the car in the grass uh, as long as you uh, keep it nice and slow and smooth the grass won't hurt you uh, now exit the tires will spin on exit that will be normal especially for the first few laps uh, going here into corner number two it's a smooth left hander just hit the brakes dab the brakes a little but then as you come out of that corner you want to get on the brakes pretty hard to set up for turn number four uh, going into turn four don't be afraid to get the car on the grass again keep it sealed right around that apex and then right when you see the exit feel free to uh, put that foot down uh, coming into turn number five keep it to the right side that's the ideal line to get into the corner and right when you pass the curbing just grab that a little bit and come around the corner. You don't necessarily need to get on the grass, but uh, you'll be fine either way. And then again, see the apex. Going into turn number seven now. Turn number seven, you want to do the same thing as going into five. Hit that curb a little bit. Don't be afraid if you, you know, dive it in a little too far. Come right around that apex, and right when you see that exit, uh, accelerate. Now be careful that exit doesn't go away you think it is, so you gotta be paying attention. Get around this little bit, you need to hop those curbs. Um, you know, there really isn't any easy way to do it. And this this corner also trips people up because they come here way too fast thinking they can just go around. And no, you need to slow down for this corner. Uh, get the car set properly. Uh, don't be afraid to use the throttle to help you turn. And uh, coming down into the final set of S's. Uh, keep it right close to the curb and then this one, this is probably the corner that trips the most people because they take too much of that curb on the brakes and they can't get slowed down fast enough and they pile it right into that rubber barrier and we don't want we don't want to have that happening. So you exit the corner, get the car up on the curb and the grass a little bit to help stabilize it. Uh, and then coming down, this is probably your hardest corner of the track. This requires perfect execution on the brakes, on the throttle, on the steering. You just want to dive in, slow the car way down, and then just mash that gas to get that car to turn because this is not a corner that suits cars very well. And don't be afraid to use the tire wall either. It's soft. It'll help. So just mash that throttle. And then when you see the exit, get the throttle, come through the gears, and go down the front straightaway. And uh, let's see, coming around. And then just like that, you have completed a lap at Sonoma.